Welcome to Webhavi tutorial series. In this video, we will discuss the various methods which can be used for extracting images from websites. We will also see how Webhavi can be configured to extract multiple images automatically from product details or property details pages. Let's start with a simple example. In this page, let's try to extract the thumbnail images displayed for each item. So we start the configuration and click on the first thumbnail image. And from the resulting capture window, click on the capture image option. You have the option to either download the image or just capture its URL. Let's select download image option and give it a name. You can see that the preview is updated with image URLs of all thumbnail images on this page. During mining, the actual image files will be downloaded to your computer and the file names will be displayed in the Miner Windows data table. Let's stop configuration and start mining. When I click the start button, Webhavi will ask me to select a folder where downloaded images are to be saved. If we do not select a folder here and hit cancel, then Webhavi will capture image URLs instead. Let's select a folder for this example and mining will start. This is the folder which I have selected where image files will be saved. You can now see that images are being downloaded and saved to this folder. Now let's try a more difficult case. If you go to our website and under help section, under selecting data, if you click on images, we have already discussed the straightforward method which works with most websites. Now let's see how images whose links are present in the HTML source code of the page can be extracted. Let's load another web page for explaining this method. Let's start configuration. Let me select the product name and then follow the first product link to get details of each products in this listings page. Here, Let's try to extract the main product image, which is this. When I click on this image, you can see that in the resulting capture window, the capture image option is disabled. What we can do now is to click on the capture HTML option and see if the image URL is present in the HTML code of the area where we clicked. Unfortunately, the image URL is not present, so we click on Capture More Content, which will select more content from around the area where we clicked. Now, I can see that the image URL is present. So how do we extract this? For this, we will have to apply a regular expression string by clicking this option. Regular expressions are coded strings which help you select only required portion from a whole chunk of text. You can do a Google search to know more about it. Or you can go to our website and under knowledge base articles we have a very simple regular expression tutorial which will give you a basic introduction. It also contains some sample regex strings which are commonly used for data extraction. So in our example, we need to get the image URL and the image URL follows this heading. So the regex string to extract the required URL portion only would be 
when I apply this regex string, you can see that Webhavi has selected only the image URL from the ball of HTML. Now you can also see that the capture image button is enabled. And if I click on it, you can provide a name and click OK. Now let's stop the configuration and start mining. And when I start, as before, Webhavi will ask me to select a folder where downloaded images are to be saved. And when mining starts, you can see that the images are downloaded to that folder and the image names will be filled in the minor windows data table. You can see that the product images have started to appear in the folder where we select it. Now let's see how we can configure Webhavi to automatically extract multiple product images from product details pages. For this example, let's try Amazon. Let's start the configuration and select each product name. We can also configure pagination if required. And then follow the first products link to load its details page. Now you can see that there are multiple product images whose thumbnails are displayed on the left hand side. To extract full sized images corresponding to these thumbnails, click on the first thumbnail and from the capture window, select the capture HTML option. And since the HTML displayed does not contain the image URL, click on the capture more content. Now we can see that the image URL is present in the HTML code. So as before, we need to apply a regex string which would extract only the URL of the image from this wall HTML code. For that, we click on the apply regex button and paste the corresponding regex string and then apply. You can see that the Pavi has now selected only the URL from the HTML and the capture image option is enabled. You can find all the regex strings used in this video in the video description. Now when I click on the capture image button, you can see that Webhavi has detected that there are multiple images on the page and is asking whether to capture them all. We click yes and give a name. In the preview, only the first image URL is updated, but during mining, all images will be extracted. Let's check that by stopping the configuration and starting mining. You can see that multiple images for each product are downloaded and saved. Their image names are updated in the preview. Here you can see that the images are named automatically based on the names given in their URLs. If we stop mining and go to Webhavi settings, under images tab, you have this option where you can name images based on the string in another column of minor windows data table. So if I select this option and here the value one means the first column which is product name. So the name of the image will be the product name itself. If there are multiple images, then they will be named by adding one, two, three, etc. to the end of the product name. We hope that you find this video useful. If you have any questions, you may contact our technical support team at the link given in the video description below. Thank you.